What is up everyone? Welcome back to Lost Odyssey. We gotta head to the Port of Numara. It is raining outside so you guys might hear the rain or whatever. It's also been lightning as well. With my microphone though you shouldn't be able to hear it too much anyway. Am I... I'm using the Shure SM7B and my micro the microphone doesn't really pick up too much background noise. The shipyard is up ahead. That's where the latest model is being built. We should go take a look. Alright, so we need to go to the center. As you can tell, it's open now. We can go through here. Go through here like we own the place. I'm not even going to try to stop us. This port belongs to us. Wow. You guys hear that? You guys probably 100% heard that. We've been ordered to outfit the ship as quickly as possible, so... Where is everyone? The general is going to get angry again. We keep him waiting. I'm surprised the power didn't go out. It just randomly stopped raining, too. Like, it's not raining now. I just heard that big lightning strike. And now it's all of a sudden not raining. The rain just went away. But there was a massive lightning strike. <laughs> It's like, what the heck? I was told we are having an emergency, but I wonder what it's all about. The area up ahead holds the military's most important secret. We're in the middle of an emergency, so turn yourself around and get... No one is getting through here without a direct order from the general. Now get out of here unless you want to get a beating. I'll The soldiers are all excited about something. Maybe something big is happening. What do they mean, get out of here? There's no need to be rude in an emergency. This is an emergency. Can't those technicians follow orders? They need to get out now. Feels like it's just a dead end there. Wow. Throw lightning pretty hard out there, guys. I'm just looking around, guys, trying to find items. Let's go this way. Let's see if we can go in this building. Nope, it's... A terminal for the white boa. Looks like they don't want us in there. Were you expecting anything else? Anyway, this isn't the place we're looking for. Yeah, of course it's going to be like... Of course they're going to secure their ships. They don't want people commandeering their ships. Even though we're going to. Whether they like it or not. They always tell us to be faster and faster, but... These things take time. Just when we already are on the verge of finishing the speedboat too. So this place is all like ruined and everything like there's vines growing everywhere and stuff. They don't keep up with maintenance around here that's for sure. We're in luck. They're just starting the final adjustments, which means that they'll be fitting the engine next. Port Numara Shipyard. Wow, this is a serious engine. Hey, what's up? Hey, how's it going? Eh? Hey, that engine. Where'd you get it? Oh, this. Uh, let's see, when was that? A while back, an unbelievably huge fish washed up on shore. This was in its belly. Wow. Checked it out and realized it could deliver incredible output, so we fixed it and installed it in the boat. Did the repairs work? Like a charm. That boat was built to be 
be General Kakanis' command vessel. Installing it is all that's left to do. Hmm, I see. Then... Eh, uh, don't mention it. Hmm, a huge fish, huh? You know, a while back... Is there something you remember? I really depended on it. Depend on what? The fish or the engine? The engine? It's from back when I was a pirate. Huh? Seth, you were a pirate? Yep, that's right. Wow! Amazing! That is so cool! Hope oh, power just went out. Look, I ain't got to worry about it because I'm on my PC, my laptop, so huh? I can keep on playing. Oh, yeah. I've always loved if, that was, if I had a desktop, it would have shut off or whatever. I, 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 read books about them for like ever. I think I haven't... Um, well, my desktop didn't power off just then. Oh, crap. I just saw a lightning strike right outside my window. Holy crap. Oh, scary. I looked over for a second and then saw it. The boat that's being built right now is the fastest in all of Numara. It's going to make its debut soon. So soon. And you don't want to miss the launch event. Finally, that should solve the problem. Come on, don't fall, fail me now. Finally, the engine is fixed. I just hope... It works this time. General is always shouting at us to get the boat moving. Strange. Doesn't seem to be here today. Take the boat. Attention, Thank you. Your ship is Thank you. Ah, <laughs> all right, should be easy. <clears throat> oh, wow, a lot of buttons there. Uh, <laughs> gonna need a manual. I think I'm out of the way. Set. Set apparently knows how to pilot it. Here goes. She used to be a pirate, after all. That was easy to commandeer. And now Mackie stops. Be the slant house control tutorial? No. Alright. So 
So R1, R2 opens the map, enlarges the map. R1 does something. I just hit it. I don't know what it does exactly. I guess it like boards the ship. Long loading screen. Yep, there we go. Okay then, where do we start? Have your memories come back? Nope, it comes in fragments. Same as you, bits and pieces. Please tell me what you meant by saying we were comrades. Do you have dreams? Yes. I do. Well, what about them? Have you ever wondered if those dreams might be fragments of your past? That there might be something turning round and round in your heart, different from the way you are now? Have you ever had a rush of feelings? Wow, you're like saying more than one word since you begin your memory back. Well, you're still as fun to be with, though. Well, <laughs> have you experienced anything like what Kaim is talking about? I'm not sure. You know that you're called the Thousand-Year-Old Queen, right? And your body is supposed to be immortal? Yes, but I don't know why I'm called that. Or, or why my body doesn't age. <laughs> I don't understand anything. That must be why Kakanis looks down on you. You've lost your purpose. It's just that... How should I put it? I often feel as though there's something terribly important that I'm forgetting. And it pains me. As though it may not be in my memories after all. But my heart remembers the pain. There have been many times recently when this has happened. My body wouldn't move, like it was exhausted. And then I, I would collapse. When I felt this vague sense of unease coming on, I would often play the harp. And that would calm my mind. So that's what you were doing when we met? Yes. Kakanis frequently advised me to lift the country from its isolation. At those times, he recommended nothing more than expanding our information about the outside world. But it seems that his true objective was something else. Now, this is what they call fate. See, meeting me was predestined. That means Kakanis just played a role. He was a pawn to make it happen. All right, that's enough fighting games. <laughs> okay! All right! <laughs> Ming, I felt the same as you until recently. My memories were locked up. Your memories were locked up? You, me, Seth, and Sarah. And one more whose name that you as queen should know. The Urin sorcerer, Gangora. <gasps> Yes, I'm aware that there is a sorcerer called Gangora, but... <sighs> the five of us were once comrades. We had a thousand-year agreement. We came to this world to accomplish something important. For that reason, we were made immortal. We don't age. When the end of the thousand-year agreement drew near, Gangora betrayed us. Though we couldn't die, he inflicted pain on us that was worse than death. Pain? What kind of... He deprived me of someone more important to me than myself. He cruelly stole her from me, and inflicted a deep wound on my heart that can never be healed. I also had something important stolen from me. Gungora used magic energy to block my memories and seal them within me. After he wiped out our entire lives, we became like living corpses. Then I too have had something very important stolen, and my memories locked away? Yes. What could possibly be so important? Don't push yourself. Take all the time you need to remember. Oh yeah, I have something to return to you. Return? To me?
This really saved me. I met you before, didn't I? Yeah. I borrowed this from you back then. I must meet with Gongora. That's what we plan to do. He's up to something that involves Grand Staff. We have to stop him. That has become our mission. Guess that means our destination is Ura, right? Hold on. If we go to Ura, we'll have to cross the ocean. In a boat like this, there's no way we'd make it. Even with your engine, Seth? It's an old clunker. Oh, it's got power to burn. But the ship itself wouldn't be able to handle the strain. It would fall apart. Aww. Why don't we head for Goza? They've made the most progress with magic technology. I am the Queen of Numata. I shall request aid from the King of Goza in the name of our countries and for the world's future. All right. So we got the ship now. I want to go inside of it and see if we could talk to like people and everything. Um, so let's do that. And then we'll head on over to Goza, I guess. There's probably some areas we can visit, though. Now that we have the ship. I can't do it. I can't remember. Huh? We know how to steer the ship. He, I bet General Testosterone is throwing a big hissy fit right about now. I don't know if there's any items on board the ship or not. Hey, does this make us pirates too? Kaim, what kind of person was your mom's mom like? I can't believe they call him Kaim instead of Grandpa. Both of my grandpas have passed away and grandmas, but... I do I board the ship again? Yeah, hit triangle to do that. Okay, there we go. So to drive this thing, all you simply do is just push the left analog stick forward. And then you can change the map with the writing analog stick. There's probably places we can explore now. So I'm going to go ahead and look that up real quick and see where we can go. We do want to go back to Namara because there's apparently a scene we can get with um, Ming. By the way, you can hop with this thing too. <laughs> kind of weird but something you can do this ship this ship can't really explore too much um, it can only go in the sh uh, where we're at now it can't really go in like uh, like deep water or anything like that so you're very limited to where you can actually go. Okay. Numara Atoli. Northern coast of Numara.
Let's go to Namara Toli. Is this a city? Did it like change its name? I don't know. Oh no, this is a new area. I don't want to be here right now. We can go to the port and I guess we can get to back to Namara from there, I guess. Assuming we can actually do that. It says you can go back for a scene, apparently. Might be some more cuts, uh, side quests we can do too. But, uh, Ming has good MP, good casting time, magic attacks to B. Port of Numbala. Northern coast of Numara. Oh, okay, that's this. Maybe we have to land in a different spot to get back there. Maybe that's what it is. What is this place? Like I triggered a scene here. I kind of wanted to explore a little more, but I guess I'm forced into a cutscene, which I hate when this happens in games. I wanted to go back to Namara. I should have saved it at the Atoli, but I didn't do it. I'm not reloading my save either, so just hopefully I didn't miss anything. An Arthrosaurus. <laughs> I know it won't move, but we gotta need to fight that thing. Look, Aunt Ming turned it to stone, and she saved the city. Whoa! You did that? Uh, <laughs> oh, she's getting uh. Hey, are you okay? It's nothing. Thanks. Hey, are you all right? Ming! You... are you starting to... Are you remembering? It always hurts when I look at the Arthrosaurus. It, it was like this even back when I was in the palace. Why don't you go rest for a bit? You're just gonna hurt yourself more if you try to remember. Thank you. I think I actually went to the wrong um, exit, though. I think I was supposed to go to the southern exit of the port, so I need to go back to the port. I think. It's love. I think that pain must mean her memories are coming back. What do you think? Yes, I have Liram to thank for getting my memories back. Ming will get hers back too. If she gives it a chance. Okay, so I want to go back. I guess we can go through here and see what... No, you can't go through here. I think this is like the ghost town, isn't it? Is that just where the ghost town was at? I think so. You can't hop everywhere. You can only hop when there's like open uh, space. I guess they didn't want you to hop over the mountains or whatever. <laughs> or hop up to places you shouldn't be hopping to, you know. This thing got some pretty good big jump. Yeah, I think I went to the wrong exit. Go back to the port and we'll go to the southern uh, path this time. I think that was where I was supposed to go. I went to the wrong exit last time. It's okay. Alright, alright, alright. 
Is there anything we could do back over here? Probably not right now, right? I'll probably have to wait till later. Yeah, it's like we can do some stuff here later. But for now, there's nothing we can do here. Let's go back to the city. And see if we can get a scene with uh, Ming. Apparently there's a scene with Ming. I like to show off all the side stuff in games. If you guys have followed this channel, you already know that. So, um, don't know why I say that a lot, but... What? We're blocked? He's angry now, that's for sure. Blame General Kakana's stupid tank. I doubt he'll be letting us through for at least a good while. The bridge has finally bit the big one. Old oh, man has stood by it ever since. It said it returned here though. For a scene, but there's nothing here. Oh well, I already went, I already explored this place and everything, so. There's no other path we, we can't get here any other way. Like, literally we're blocked. But can I enter the city at this point, so. Anyway, that'll be the first episode. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode and later.